Hi, I'm Anthony Day Gordon, Canadian visual artist. I'd like to show you my latest piece that I'm working on, and I'm going to call this piece Camouflage Plumage. And the reason why I'm going to call this piece Camouflage Plumage is because it's actually telling the story of a pair of birds nesting. Here's the first bird. This would be the bird's beak, the head of the bird, the neck of the bird, the body of the bird, the wings of the bird. Here you see the legs of the bird and then nesting, incubating two eggs. And these birds are fantail birds, so they've got beautiful plume tail-like lace. And overall, this is what I called camouflage plumage. It's still very early in the pencil work. Lots of pencil work to be done on this one. Really looking forward to seeing how this one's going to be finalized. Camouflage plumage. This is my latest piece that I'm working on. And the last video, I showed you Samson between two rhinos. Now I want to show you the final piece. So this is the finalized piece of Samson between two rhinos. I have the halo showing a heavenly descent. So I'm going to call this one Spiral Prince because it really shows Samson between two rhinos is like ultimate power. The rhino as a herbivore is powerful, very aggressive and it's always been a symbol of power. And Samson being a prophet with the ultimate power, I say would be a suited place to place in between two rhinos. This is a continuation of the Samson series that I'm coming up with. I hope you enjoy it. Now, the mediums that I favor is ink, graphite, and charcoal. And on this piece, the heavily dark shaded area would be the charcoal. The lighter area would be the graphite. The body of the prophet is also a softer graphite. The hair and body of the rhino, which is solid black, is ink, Indian ink. Working with these medium, it just brings out your feelings, which is connected to your spirit, and it's extremely warm in composition. As humans, we like warmth, so we naturally draw closer to something that is warm. And the composition of ink, graphite, and charcoal is very warm. How I came up with the Samson series, I didn't really decide a topic to say that I'm going to draw a Samson. My true goal within the Samson series is to actually draw a more accurate, truer depiction of a bird soaring without actually drawing the bird. It makes me look forward to seeing what I come up with when it comes to this Samson series.